what's up goddess gang today we are back with another video and today we're going to be doing a little nail design we have some madam glam in the cut if you guys know me you know i love me some madam glam and i also really love king of glam by madam glam which is the little dots all over the nail but there's also this one which is called uh, what is it called inner peace oh. I would have never guessed that I forgot totally but that's inner peace and you guys have seen inner peace on my channel before I really like this color it's a baby pink which with like a, a orangish peaches peachish hue very subtle um and then I was just gonna wear that but I really was like I want a little king of glam in the cut because we haven't seen king of glam in a while and I just I have to use it it's so pretty so we're back to using these tips from um, a previous unboxing that you guys saw it was from Shein and I do like these tips but I would like them to be tapered in um, so that they can be a really tapered square they're a little bulky for me um, but that's neither here nor there and I'm, I'm totally undecided about how I feel about the more square top like I like the square top on the thumb because it fits in but on the other fingers it does look a little weird so I might even decide like maybe I should taper in around the cuticle area too um, but we'll decide in the final result this is just the first part of this video because um, I haven't fully decided what I want to do on these nails and I wanted to talk to you guys to see what you think that I should do and this nail design is primarily to show you guys some of these wonderful products by Madam Glam, but also to show you how easy it can be to create super beautiful nail art with the right supplies. As you guys know, I did unbox these new brushes from Beatles not too long ago. And um, one of the brushes specifically on this one right here you guys can see this one is basically to create the petals of the flowers and so this is like the perfect brush for it and i have been focusing on like okay how can i make my nail art go easier for me because a lot of times we see people who create beautiful products or out like they can be creating a car or they can be creating a website or they can be creating you know home decor or nail art or whatever and what one person can do with the same supplies can be totally different than what another person can do with the same supplies um but and when i say supplies i mean like car parts or like these pudding gels and things like that and what it really comes down to is the tools that you choose to use and so a lot of my nail art whenever it doesn't come out the exact way that i envision i almost always tell myself it's because you're not using the right tools and i've wanted to what's up goddess gang i wanted to personally introduce you to my amazon storefront here we have miscellaneous nail supplies nail room equipment nail accessory must-haves nail art decor the list goes on we also have special features from brands that you guys have seen on my channel before so be sure to go check out scorpion goddess nails on amazon storefront and i've wanted to use these um these pudding gels for a long time and create some really flawless beautiful work with them but I didn't really have the right tools so when I got this brush and I was like okay I know that this brush is going to be good for making the pet the uh, flower petals I just knew that I had to give it a try and I knew that I had to use the Madame Glam pudding gels for this so that's what we're doing you guys are going to see we're going to create a spring or um, nature inspired nail set is going to be a little playful but at the end I would like for you guys to tell me what else I should do to make these nails really pretty should I like convert them into maybe like a spongebob theme nails because it's kind of giving um sandy it's kind of giving sandy or should I like put butterflies on them make like decorate them with some 3d butterflies or what should i do with them i also really wanted them to kind of be textured but somewhere throughout the process i ended up using a regular gel polish to kind of outline the flowers and it kind of messed up the texturized look a little bit because it like what do they call it it honed it in 
and I was a little undecided about how I ended up liking that but overall I think they turned out really beautiful like really beautiful and now that I'm looking at the nails yeah they are kind of squarish at the top they're not as squarish um for the smaller tips but they still have like this squarish they're very squarish but anyways, I'm going to let you guys listen to some music while you watch me do this application because it's super simple. It's super easy. Um, there's not really a lot for me to tell you guys. One thing I will say is that you got to put each petal over the next petal. You can't have some petals under and some petals over unless you specifically want to do the nails like that. But if you don't want to and you just want them to look kind of like regular old simple flowers, be sure to do one petal and then the next petal and then the next petal and then the next petal. So if you mess up on one petal, then you got to go all the way back and you got to redo each petal until you get back to the petal that you need to fix. Um, and it can get a little crazy, but I'm really proud with how I did and I would look forward to doing more nail designs similar to this. If you guys have any that you've seen that you're inspired by that you would like to let me like to see me recreate, just tag me on Instagram in the photo so that I can hopefully recreate cuz when it comes to these nail designs, I feel like there's so many people who have already done them that there's really not a innovative moment to have. It's more so just like a recreation from inspired works and things like that. And I am going in with the Born Pretty uh, matte top coat. I should have done that before I did the second layer of the pudding gel. Um, but that's neither here nor there. Once we do that, we're going to go in with our regular gel polish. And we're going to basically do an outline, which turned out pretty cute. But it was a hit or miss like it was definitely a hit or miss so you guys can let me know if I kind of messed the nails up or what and then also for the center of the nails I don't think there's really going to be any center of the nails um, since they're all kind of hanging off of the edges but I would like to know what else like I could create with these pudding gels what other kind of nail designs that I could create I feel like they're best for scenics or for basically scenics because they're texturized and I think landscapes or like uh, nature type of art looks really well with them. I think I'm going to really use those the green colors. I'm going to create like a super beautiful green set, even though I did do the spring goddess and she was mostly all green. Um, these are pudding gels, so I'm going to try to use those for something super cute and cool. I definitely would love to have your guys' input, so don't hesitate to go ahead and comment down below and let me know what you think. Also, I do want to remind you guys that if you enjoy my videos, please ring the notification bell so that you can be notified every single time I upload. That way we can keep in contact and we don't lose each other with the algorithm, which is ever changing online. But without further ado, I will be back. I'm going to let you guys go ahead and watch me continue to apply and we'll go from there. <music> What's up, Goddess Gang? Today, we're going to give a special shout out to Madam Glam New York. As you guys know, we absolutely love Madam Glam at the Goddess Gang. They have so many beautiful colors to choose from. You can either get individuals or you can save by getting bundles. They have full size and they have mini size for us girlies who are a little indecisive. Not to mention the color palettes and the actual formula itself is just absolutely wonderful. Babes, when you check out at Madam Glam, you can select to check out as a VIP member for a subscription or you can choose pay as you go use my discount code to save. 